Hello, my name is Jonus Kitik. I'm representing Liter of Light Netherlands and today, together with my brother Gabriel, we're gonna present how to assemble and build a street night solution. For that, our first step is to gather or buy all the materials necessary in order to construct a street night solution. I'm gonna start with the upper part of our street light solution and we're gonna need a solar panel with a power of 8.7 volts having attached a PFC pipe lead in order to sustain our solar panel on the back. For that we're gonna connect a 30 centimeters PFC pipeline on the solar panel in order to be more stable. And we're gonna need two of these because we're gonna connect also with our uh, LED which is 3 volts LED in order to illuminate the streets. We're gonna need 6 connectors. 4 connector, normal connectors, 1 T connector, 1 45 degree connector and also we're gonna need one connector for our battery and PFC pipeline. Moreover, we'll continue with our downward part which will need following parts. Firstly, we will need a PFC pipe that is two meter and a half tall in order to have uh, the, the, the our street light to be tall enough in the, for the light dispersion. A wood platform where we'll connect all our upper part and downward part and also, if you, if you can observe it, we'll put our battery in here to connect and that our, our system to, to work. What was not specified that we'll put a 7 volts with 4.5 4 amps inside the, uh, with, uh, connected with the circuit and inside our street light solution and also we build our special circuit for this kind of battery. Second step consists in building a circuit. In our case, we already have the circuit built, but if you like to see how to construct a circuit, you can click the link below and you can have a tutorial about how to gather all the components in order to have a circuit for our measurements. For having the circuit done, we need to take more wire and extend it to fit our uh, measurements of the street lights of two meter and a half. At the end of each wire, we put it a plastic wire connector. So for this, we need six wire connectors, two that will connect to the solar panel, two that will connect to the bulb, and two that will be connected to the battery itself. Moreover, the battery part we need two automotive wires, two automotive connectors that we will connect it to the battery itself. After getting all the materials done and the circuits built, we're gonna start to assemble our street light solution, which is the step three of our tutorial. The first thing that we need to do is to fit our circuits inside these PFC pipes for the safety of the circuit and the stability of it. So first we will get through the wires, through, through the PFC pipe and fit it, the circuit inside, the, inside the, the pipe. Fitting the circuit inside, the next step is to, is to fit with our T in order to start build our upper part of the street light. So after after introducing the circuit, we're gonna take the T and introduce the low in the lower part all the circuits and upper part onto the solar panel. So we're gonna take the extended circuits and first we're gonna introduce the lower part, which which will be connected to the battery itself. So the lower part is done, and now we and now we'll connect. We'll uh, get him through the wires that will be connected to the solar panel.
having having done this, we'll just plug our PFC pipes inside the T connector. Having done this, the next uh, the next step is to just assemble our uh, 90 degrees uh, part by putting a PFC connector. And also here, for the upper part, we're gonna put again a normal connector. The next step is to just plug the PFC pipe inside it. And the connector again. Which all of this will be connected with the solar panel itself. After having our upper part, the next step is to start assemble the downward part. So for this we'll need to take the long wire of two meter and a half and get it through our PFC pipe, the longest PFC pipe that we have. After introducing all the wires through this two meters uh, pipe, we just put our upper part, what we constructed earlier, and we just connect it. After fitting all the wires through our PFC pipe, the next step is to have a bamboo with you that will serve for the stability of the street light. What I did with the bamboo is that I, ca I carved for, to fit the wires that will be connected to the battery and also I drill a hole where I put a screw that will serve as well for the stability of the street light. With, with the bamboo in my hand, now I will feed the wires that will be connected to the battery. And fitting the bamboo inside of the PFC pipe, where everything will fit in our wood support. So, Having the, our bamboo in the PFC pipe, we will need to be careful to fit with the, uh, with the holes that we drill as well as in the, our PFC pipe and as well in, uh, in our bamboo. Now, having all, uh, all the parts together, we will start to fit our solution in our wood support that we constructed. After finishing our streetlight solution, we have the downside support, the wood support, where we can gonna fit our bamboos into the hole. As you can see, I drilled the hole inside for a better fitting of the bamboo, and also we have the place for the battery in order to protect from the rain and storms. The next step is to fit the battery inside, and also we need to fit our connector PFC connector uh, with the, our upper part. After fitting our PFC lid with the whole, whole upper part of the solution, now we'll fit a nail through it, through the holes that we drill, through the bamboo PFC pipe and this PFC lid, and make it stable as we can. Having done this, now we'll fit all the parts that we built until now into our wood support. But first we need to connect to the battery our system. Having the wires connected, now we'll try to fit our solution inside. inside our wood support. So now you need to push a little bit. After fitting our upper part with the lower part, which is a wood support, now we need to connect two more pieces, our solar panel and our bulb. An important thing that you need to know is just to connect the right polarities on the right sides. After, fit, after fitting our button inside, you can see that our, our solution is already lightening. And the only part that we need to do is just to install 
the solar panel to the to our solar to our solar. Mm -hmm. Our solution is done. Having our solution assembled, now we will just quickly summarize all the three steps used. The first step was getting all the uh, all the components uh, together. The con from connectors until the battery, the bulb and the solar panel. The second step was about getting the circuits done and extending their wires that can get through all the our system here. The third step was to assemble the solution itself. From the upper part until the bottom, uh, the bottom where we connect it with our wood support, which instead should be the gravel, sand and cement. Enjoy! Bye! Oh, 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 oh,